and its consistent. Is that Wendy? Please help welcome up Alan Bentley. How to choose a spouse? How to choose a spouse? Alan Bentley. If you're thinking of getting married for the first time, or even a second time, or even a third time, you will need to choose a spouse, and I can help you. <coughs> Mr. Contest Chair, fellow Toastmasters and guests, a long time ago when I was 21, my father said, son, soon you'll be looking to choose a spouse. Here is the family manual, that will help you, it's been used for generations. He then handed me an old copy of the Reader's Digest <laughs> with the article, How to Choose a Car. <laughs> he said, if you read it carefully, but interpret it wisely, you'll have no problems. The article said there are five rules in choosing a car. One, have a budget. <laughs> Don't spend outside your budget. Interpret that. In choosing a spouse, don't choose someone you can't afford. <laughs> Rule two, choose the type of car you want. Do you want a sports car? A family car? Or a ute? A working car? <laughs> spouse with a high maintenance, a family spouse with a mortgage and the children, or do you want the youth, the working spouse with a job can support themselves? <laughs> Rule three, safety. In your car, you will be involved in a collision. <laughs> Choose a car that you feel safe in. <laughs> There will be domestic collisions. Choose a spouse you feel safe with. Choose a spouse smaller than you. <laughs> Rule four, maintenance. Some cars use more water, more petrol, more tires, more grooming than others. Don't choose a spouse who drinks a lot. <laughs> eats a lot. Costs a lot of money for clothes and shoes. <coughs> and for grooming. But, number five, rule five, the important one. Resale. <laughs> if you choose the right car, Someone will tap you on the shoulder and say, Excuse me, if you're thinking of making a change, can I have first right of refusal? <laughs> if you choose the right spouse, you'll be asked the same question. <laughs> How do I know this manual works? Because one year later, when I was 22, I went out to choose a spouse. Rule one, I had a small budget and I only chose what I could afford. Rule two, not the sporting spouse, too expensive for me. Not the family spouse with the mortgage and the children. But the youth, the working spouse, the one who had a job could support themselves. That's what I chose. Rule three, safety. I knew there were going to be domestic collisions. So I chose a spouse smaller than me. I chose a female jockey. Rule four, maintenance. Now you know why I chose the female jockey. Drink half a cup of milk for the whole week. Eat. 
pieces of toast, one chicken drumstick, two jelly beans for the whole week. <laughs> Clothes. Every race meeting she goes to, they give her these silk shirts, <coughs> beautiful colours which she keeps. Shoes. She's got the same boots from the day I met her. <laughs> they never wear out. She never walks on the road. Every day on the horse. <laughs> to the hairdressers. Why? Every day she wears a jockey's helmet. <laughs> Number five. Resale. <laughs> You'll be surprised what an asset a female jockey is. How do I know that this manual works? When I look around, I ask myself, what about rule five? When we were standing at the altar getting married, she was standing there in full jockey's regalia. She looked beautiful. I was next door, standing there in my Polynesian floral hangout shirt, the Polynesian sarong, and brand new jangles. I looked pretty beautiful too. The minister, he looked at us like this with a big grin on his face. And then he got this smirk when he saw she was carrying a jockey's whip. <laughs> <laughs> but we won't go down that road, will we? <laughs> now when I look around the room, I see a few twinkles in the eyes, a few frowns. Well, if you're thinking of choosing a spouse, I told you I could help you. I will lend you this family manual. If you read it carefully, but interpret it wisely, you'll have no regrets. Unlike my wife of 50 years, every day she tells me, had I seen that manual when I first met you, I wouldn't have ended off with a lemon. <laughs> 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 <laughs>